All right, I'm gonna make a quick video and I'm gonna talk about good behaviors that your dog offers. Uh, there is a good chance that your dog is offering good behaviors on a pretty significant proportion that you're not paying attention to or that you're taking for granted. Uh, just to give you a quick, uh, quick number, there's a good chance that out of 10 behaviors, just, just a quick number, reference, out of 10 behaviors, there's a good chance that eight of them are probably good behaviors and maybe one or two of them are bad behaviors. And the problem is most of us have this tendency to only focus on those bad behaviors. There's a good chance that most of us are only taking action on those bad behaviors, that we're taking for granted the good behaviors, that we're not paying attention to them, uh, that we're not doing much to reinforce those good behaviors. And it makes it seem like, you know, your dog has issues. Well, out of those 10 behaviors, if your dog does perform two, uh, eight good behaviors um, and only two bad behaviors, you know, they twice out of those 10 times they make the wrong choice. It might seem that you have an unruly dog. And in fact, you might. But what I'm trying to get at is that you have eight opportunities at least to reinforce the right behavior. And that's what we that's what we don't do. That's what a lot of people have a hard time doing. So my challenge to you guys and it's you know, a challenge to myself as well. It's something I have to remind myself constantly. Uh, my challenge to you guys is to uh, focus on the proper, the good behaviors that your dog makes, the right choices. There are times when your dog is probably being calm that you're not reinforcing. There are times when your dog is choosing to lay down versus jumping. There are times when you your dog is choosing to be polite versus being inappropriate. There are times when, you ch when your dog chooses to focus on you, even if it's for a few seconds, versus focusing on something else. Well, take those opportunities to let your dog know, hey, I like that, you know, I appreciate that, I like it, I want more of it, and I'm going to reinforce that behavior and give a jackpot even. You know, from time to time, your dog makes the right choice, give him a jackpot. Uh, it's a great way to reinforce those behaviors and get more of them. And this also works with people. You know, if you have any type of relationship with a person and you're constantly nagging at them, if you're constantly bringing up their faults, or if you have a person that does that to you, first of all, it doesn't make you feel good. Uh, and it seems that that relationship is very counterproductive. But there is a good chance that this person also has good qualities that you're missing. This person has good is making good choices that you're not letting them know, hey, that was the right choice. And it can make a big difference when uh, dealing with people and uh, dealing with dogs, working with dogs. So it's something that we definitely want to pay attention to and we want to reward those good choices so we get more of them.